See, buddy be just like us. We got bags in hand. Yeah, that's how we be right now. See, just like that. suit, bag. <laughs> yes, sir. Hey, Big Mark, good luck in the draft. Appreciate it. Kill it. Yeah, that's man. That's exactly how we be. What? That's crazy. See, you famous. You, you seen that? <laughs> <laughs> Random people versus Yeah, <laughs> hey, <no. laughs> hey, yeah. yeah. I got first got in Florida State. And I weighed in at 365, and Dale looked at me. He said, if you're not 330, or at least close to 330 by the season, don't even ask me about playing time. Balls at least every day after workout. No, at least an hour. That's Sonna. I was on And that's Sonna. 40 minutes of cardio, but I had to lose that weight. That Sonna used to be so high. I don't, oh I don't know, God. like, do y'all like the Sonna or y'all like the, um, the steam room? The steam, like the steam, steam, steam room. room better. Steam yeah, the steam room where you yeah. sweating in two minutes. Boy, that steam room like the steam room your pores open up, everything. Yeah, the steam room. I used to hit that steam room in the uh, leech faithfully, boy. All the time. I never get that North Carolina game with Coach Fuller, but he was so turned the whole game with going crazy. That game, that, that was lit. That game, I ain't gonna lie, that's probably one of my like one of the best like experiences, like game experiences here. Nah, that is for me. Can't look all that pick six. I'm gonna say, I think I set the tone though. Like it's the first play of the game I had at TFL. Limited sample, they're three and zero. Played Syracuse, Boston College, and Virginia Tech. Yeah, Matt Williams yeah. dumped for a loss. Yeah, there was a lot of plays that game though. I ain't gonna lie, everybody, everybody made plays. Everybody made plays. Poker like, went deep. Got it off with the rush coming. Ontario Wilson dies toward the pylon. I was like, okay. I know that final drive, bro. I was cramping at the last drive, and I'm like, man. We played, good. we played a good game overall, like offense and defense well, that game, though. You need and want Florida State to be good again. It's good for college football. This is a great place with great tradition. And this was a tremendous win for the Seminoles tonight. I was on Instagram Live for like an hour. <laughs> <laughs> they had us losing by like 21, 28. Yeah, we were shot everybody though. With the hurricane, when I lost my house, you know what I'm saying? That could have been a reason for me to like, for me give up and like give in, you know what I'm saying? But like. I understood like certain situations happen for a reason and I could use this for a positive, you know, motivation wise, you know, just to hold on. Um, emotionally it was hard just, you know, losing my house and losing everything. You know, a house that I grew up in, my mom grew up in, like my whole family basically grew up in the house, just losing it. You know, in the spur of like a storm unexpectedly. You know, it was really tough, but like I said, I flipped that into a positive. I mean, every day to play football is a blessing. You gotta understand, like, it's a lot of people that want to be in our position doing what we do. Fact, you know, it's a lot of it's a lot of my homeboys, you know, that that was talented enough to make it to this level, but just to keep their head on straight, you know, and start the streets and, and doing what they need to do to, you know, excel at this level. So, like I said, every day just being able to do something that a lot of people don't have the opportunity to do is just a blessing. You know, been out here with my brothers. Yeah, every time I think about pro day, I get the chills, man, because I, Lord knows, I've been working all my life for this, and uh. I know a lot of people depend on me to do good, and I'll just use that as motivation and just go out there and do what I do. And I've been grinding for the past couple months and basically my whole life. Oh, I know they're gonna cry. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry for sure. I ain't gonna I'm gonna sure. cry. Because I know everybody been in that position when they were just telling their people, yeah. you're gonna make it one day, dog. And you really locked in. Now you're in a position to actually make it. To you make it. Yeah. So it's like, it's like you can tell your mama, like, mama, I ain't go back on my promise. You know what I'm saying? I held, I held it down. So it's like, yeah. get all our families yeah. in better situations, man. Just knowing that I put so much work in from 
Little League to high Little League, school, middle school to high school, to college. college. Yeah. Now we here. Then the, the pre-draft process, yeah. all this going on. Just, and then all the other stuff that came with outside of football, yeah. bro. All the stuff, the adversity, the good times. The bad, bad. all of it. Mm -hmm. It's just going to be a lot. It was nice to play somewhere where there's so much tradition and so many elite level guys before me. But growing up on the east side of the county, of Baltimore County, uh, it wasn't always pretty, but I always kept the pushing and never gave up. I'm right where I dreamed about being, you know. Being versatile is a part of football, like it's an important part of the game. You can't just line up in the same thing all the time. I want to be the guy that they move around and, and for the challenge that they need, like the challenge of the week, they, they, they feel comfortable putting me in that spot to where I can be the guy that they depend on to make the play. Playing at Florida State, I love Florida State. You know, it felt like a home to me. They surrounded me by a lot of um, good people. You know, I've seen a lot of great people, and it just ever since then it just felt like home. So, you know, once I got to Florida State, you know, I, I knew there was the place for me. Whatever I'm willingly asked or ready to do, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm ready to do. Um, whether it's dropping the coverage. Uh, in a 3-4 defense or, you know, be a 5-in and a 3-4 defense or be a 5-in and a, you know, 4-down defense. I'm uh, versatile and able to play, you know, multiple uh, positions and spots. On the defense, everybody has to, all 11 guys have to make sure they tackle and um, you can't just be a cover corner and uh, expect to thrive in the NFL or in college, you have to be a tackling corner. So I uh, pride myself in tackling. I feel like size doesn't matter, it's about the heart and the dog mentality you have on that field. My greatest strength, I feel like my instincts and my ball skills, um, I feel like I can track the ball very well and um, be able to make plays on the ball wherever the ball is at. It really doesn't matter to me what team I go to. Um, I've played in so many different schemes here at Florida State. You know, I've been talking to different teams. Uh, some have 3-4 defenses, some have 4-2-5, some has a 4-3, uh, you know, and I played in all three of those defenses here at Florida State. So, you know, I um, played everything from a zero to a five. So um, I have so much experience at different positions, so it, doesn't, it really doesn't matter. That's why I feel like the sky is the limit for me because I've made plays in almost every position. Cherish every opportunity, every moment you got. Like Facts. you got four years, five years maximum at a, at a college, at a university. You only got a certain amount of times that you're gonna play in the stadium. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? So seize every opportunity that you got when you inside Dope Campbell or whatever stadium you're at. Them three years for me definitely flew by. Though I ain't gonna lie. They used to tell me it's gonna fly by, but yeah, we're going yeah. Like I said, for me it's been five years, bro. I feel like I just stepped on campus early and early, bro. For me, it's the love of the game. Like the money is the money. Like you know what I'm saying? It, it, it ain't the dollars. It's, it's the love of the game that's gonna keep that mentality. All I hear is that war chant. Uh, <laughs> we, oh, boy, yeah. all I hear right now, boy. Definitely keep going out. All I can think about right now is these sprints running down. <laughs> That boy Mar blocked the field goal right here. Oh, yeah. And I, uh, I tried to scoop it and go. Uh. Zombie trying to get it, too. Yeah. <laughs> Zombie talking about pitch it, pitch it. Yeah. <laughs> you I got to fourth it. down stop we got right here, boy, against North Carolina last year. Oh, yeah, yeah. for sure, though. We had a lot of bringing the extra old lineman out, dumping them. Yeah, <laughs> that was hard. That was hard. Yeah, we turned up. Because I'm thinking, yeah. me and Coop the whole time, Coop got to really knock that thing back. Yeah. And I'm scooping. And I'm looking up, all I see is buddy go up on the ball. Like, yeah, bro. I was like, because we practiced yeah. that all week when they bring in the extra old lineman as a tight end. Yeah. I was like, oh yeah, they definitely running it right here. Mm -hmm. It's fourth down, bro. I just tried to get up on him. It's an extra tight end. Mm -hmm. Right on his back. Bobby down the field at Dope Campbell. Mm -hmm. Jeez. Man. We won't never play on this no more, bro. That's crazy. That's what I be thinking about. We ain't gonna never play on this field. No I ain't gonna more. lie. I, can, I know y'all boys have been tired one time. And y'all look up there and be like, nah, I gotta be just like them boys. Yeah, gee. No yeah. cow. Florida State, I mean, you gonna play with great guys, NFL type of talent, compete every single day. You got the tradition. You always gonna be 
on big stages every day. So if you want that pressure and you want to be the best, you come to Florida State.